Two at 10 o'clock, a house hit several times by drivers deemed too dangerous to live in by the homeowners. They hoped the city would buy the property from them. But city council voting no this week. Kayla McCarthy spoke with the family about what's next. The Campanelli's house has been hit four times since 2017. Their front door is still boarded up from the last time it was hit back in November. And now that the city of Illyria won't buy their property from them, they hope they can find a way to move on. This property itself, we have always felt that no other dwelling should be here. The Campanelli's say where their home is on Chestnut Ridge Road is dangerous. Their son-in-law, Michael Whitlock, says the measures taken to stop the crashes into their house haven't worked. They had hoped the city of Illyria would buy the property so they could move somewhere safe. We took this avenue to give the city a chance uh, to do what was right. Uh, they've decided not to go that route, so now we'll explore all our other options. The couple has survived four car crashes into their home, the latest in November. A driver being chased by Illyria police lost control and crashed at a high speed. And more than a dozen times, cars have run through their yard. It's an infamous house. Council President Vic Stewart says the council began discussing the idea of buying it late last year. But we looked at it as for uh, using city taxpayers' dollars to purchase a private individual's home. We didn't feel that was a precedent that was going to be being set not only for the Campanelli's, but down the road for any future other accidents in the city. Stewart says the council is looking into ways to make this intersection more safe, including the possibility of rumble strips. So maybe we look at additional stop signs at critical other intersections, adding some type of speed bump. Whitlock says his in-laws, who have lived here for more than three decades, don't feel safe returning to their home. They have been roller coaster of emotions. Uh, you know, they, they get their, their down moments where they're having to start over. Uh, they get their angry moments when, you know, the things don't turn out and their disappointments, but they're strong people. Reporting in Illyria, Caitlin McCarthy, 19 News.